Welcome back to Good Day Chicago, everyone. It is a beautiful day out here, and July is National Grilling Month. So here at Good Day Chicago, we brought in the pros mm -hmm. to grill with us today. We've got Ed Nemec and Head Chef Jackson from Dance and Marlin with us today. And guys, you have brought quite the spread. What on earth are we looking at? This stuff looks amazing. We've got some great things to go through with you today. Um, on the grill, we've got some prawns, we've got clams and we've got some Hawaiian grouper that we're going to talk to you about. All great fish. We bring in fish from Hawaii every week. This is Hawaiian grouper. It's called Hapu Pu and uh, we're going to be grilling that up today. If you can't find that, you can use regular grouper. We've got prawns. They look like lobster prawns. tails are so uh, big. They're big, but we're a shareable restaurant. We like everybody to pass food around, so that's a great thing to pass around I don't know. The you table. put that on my plate. I might not be sharing. <laughs> it you looks too good. Care. No one's going to mess with okay. you. You don't have to share. And then we're doing clams today because that's a great a great dish for the summer on the grill. Really easy to do. They open up automatically. We've got a, a butter garlic sauce that we add to them. And it's Never thought really, about doing clams before. Really easy on the grill. I mean, this is stuff that you can get in any grocery store. Put them on there. It's just fun. Um, little tips that we do. You know you got to start off with a really clean grill. Um, so it's clean. You know, sometimes you run out of, you can't find your, your, your grill brush. We use foil sometimes, not at the restaurant, of course, but at home. And that gets that grill nice and That's clean. That's very nice. Really? My grill does not look quite like this. It's yeah. a little bit, you know, <laughs> well, crusty. My partner's a specialist in cleaning grills, and he got this thing immaculate for us. So if your grill's dirty, we'll send it over to Ray's house. Okay. Uh, also, especially when you're grilling fish, um, you want to get a little bit of oil on that grill. You want this nice and clean like that. And you can see how that just shimmers. So when we take that piece of fish, it's not going to stick. Very Obviously, nice. you don't want to hear this sizzle. Yeah. Yeah. Um, also, a little tip with the, the prawns over here. Um, you know, I decide to skewer uh, fish always at the last minute, and I always forget to soak my skewers because they'll burn up really fast on a grill. So, a little tip. Take some skewers the night before, put oh, them in water, that. soak them, but then I put them in the freezer. So the next day, I pull those skewers out of the freezer, and when I skewer them, they're filled with moisture, they're cold, and they won't burn, so you don't get that crispy blackness oh. on the end of your Very skewer. Nice. Now, I, I, you know, I've broiled and boiled clams on countless occasions. I never would have thought of grilling them. You know, right. What's the benefit of grilling clams? Well, you know, you want to do this all outside. It's grilling month, you know, right. so we don't want to be inside. We don't want to be, you know, slaving over a hot pan or a stove. So doing these on the grill is great. We do oysters at the restaurant on the grill, you know, and we'll just let them pop open and then a little, you know, fiery Parmesan butter. Um, and they're great, so they're really easy to do. Oh, well, yeah. I'm grilling in January, but I'm just that kind of guy. <laughs> hey, tell us what you have over here. Yeah, let's yeah. see the after. So here's our clams that we did, topped with that little garlic butter and tarragon. There's also some yuzu um, on top of there, you, a little tobiko. Some what? Yuzu? yuzu tobiko. It's like a caviar. Oh, yeah. I, I, Mel, you have that all the time. Yeah, yeah right, that, right. actually for breakfast today, yeah. how did you know? My yuzu yeah, tobiko. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, and then this is our Hawaiian fish, the hapu Yeah, that um, too. I yeah, that, you talk about that all the time. Uh, then the, the prawns, obviously, that we grilled. And this, I know, you know, we're, we didn't come here to do steak, but because we're a sharing, American Sharing Plates restaurant, this is our, our steak. We do one steak, we do it really well. We cut it like this and serve it Tuscan style. And uh, everybody can grab a piece and just have fun at the table. These are our wines over here. We have 18 wines on tap now. Wow. Um, we have eight handcrafted cocktails on tap. I have on wines tap. on tap at my house that come out of a little cardboard box. <laughs> it's right there in the refrigerator. Well, it's kind of the same, yeah. the same concept. Um, but we, we're really proud of our cocktail program and our wine program. We've got a lot. It's a really fun restaurant. It's made to bring your friends, family. It's communal seating in some areas. Yeah. You've got a big kitchen table. You can watch all these guys you know, cook right there. Sounds like a fun place. It's more than fun. We it's can watch fun. Jackson hard at work, <laughs> and you're the man behind the scenes. I'm the happen. man behind the scenes, and he does all the hard. He does the heavy lifting. I do all the fun stuff. Well, yeah. thank you guys so much for thank coming in. So We're going to sample this as soon as we come back from commercial break. Right now, mm. we'll be right back. I'm just going to prep my.